Hello everyone. This video will give you a brief introduction of a new Eclipse plugin called Camelin. Uh, Camelin is developed by myself. If you are going to uh, contact us about the uh, Camelin plugin, you can access the website www.camelin.com. Uh, you can make your request here and then I will respond to you as soon as possible. The benefit to use uh, Camelin is that uh, Eclipse can capture a screen video without installing a third party uh, screen capturing uh, application. Some applications may need extra money to buy a license. But if you have uh, Eclipse and then you install the uh, the plugin Camelin, you can capture your screen uh, in any time. For example, if you are going to uh, teach something or if you are going to uh, explain the program or design or anything uh, you want. Uh, to the peers or your colleagues, then you can use Camelin. Okay. Camelin has some functionalities. The first function is to uh, like start capturing screen video. This button actually is already activated because before I can explain this to you, I have to start it first. Uh, this button actually stop the capturing screen video. So after you uh, finish your explanation or lecturing, then you can stop it. Okay. After you stop it, your your video will be saved uh, in a AVI file, and then automatically. Converted to a FLV file. Okay. If you are going to check your video file, uh, you can find in your view. If you don't have a view here, you can go to Window, Show View, Other. Then you can find a Camelin view. Just uh, click Camelin. Then OK. Then your view here, right? Your view here. You can open this. Open material and you can find your video file. Uh, actually, after I stop it, uh, this there is a FLV file, FLV file here. Before, uh, because I I did I, I can't stop here right now, so you cannot see the FLV file. Okay, another function is to take a screen snapshot. So if you are going to take a photo, you find that this uh, picture is very good, and then you can take a photo, you can use this function. Okay. Uh, another a little complicated function is to add a handwriting toolbar. That's actually applied to a, a editor. For example, if you have a Java editor here, Open a Java editor. Okay, here. So in this Java editor, if you are going to uh, explain this program to your uh, colleagues, you can add a uh, toolbar in the up top, in the top. Yeah, in this top. Okay, you have this toolbar. The toolbar has the start uh, handwriting, stop handwriting, uh, set color, uh, line color, set line wise, or clear handwriting, or uh, close this toolbar. Okay, so uh, let's explain this. Okay, so firstly, we start handwriting. Uh, after we started, we can stop it. Okay, we can do other things. Now, this is a function called Creator, it will create a grid, then return this grid object. First statement is a uh, new uh, grid object. Then you have a loop to rate the uh, integer one by one. Uh, 
after you read the integer, firstly you have to check if the integer is less than zero or not. If it is a negative, you have to return no. Okay. So this is uh, you find this is uh, too many uh, notes. Uh, maybe you like to clear. Okay. Then you maybe you change it blue, and then to check if the uh, character integer is equal to a uh, uh, hash, then you can skip it and read more integer. Okay. Right. I finish my handwriting. I don't want to write any more. Then stop handwriting. Then you can still you can uh, edit it. Okay. So, but when you uh, uh, start handwriting, you cannot edit anything because uh, your mouse is the mouse control is taken by this uh, button. Okay. Stop handwriting and then. Edit your program, uh, clear handwriting, or uh, close the bar, and then you can stop uh, your capturing if you feel uh, your lecturing is completed. Okay. Then after you uh, stop it, your video file is generated automatically. You can check it from here. Uh, when you double click this video file, and then your video file will be played. Okay. You can also uh, maybe send an email to uh, your friend. Uh, this video file will be attached to your email. Or you can publish your email to a cloud like YouTube. Okay. This uh, video file will be automatic automatically published to the cloud. Uh, Okay, this is the function of Camelin plugin. Uh, I have finished uh, this lecture. Thank you for your listening.